Hello everybody, I am back. Today I'm gonna show you how to draw uh, some shit similar from my little pony Escura Escura Girls. I hope I am pronouncing this right. So I've never seen this show before, but I know this. She's a pretty popular character. Okay, so we just uh, gonna draw her today. Okay, so we're gonna draw her in a pretty um, <coughs> Pretty weird position, okay, because she's uh, holding an apple juice that she don't like. Okay, so we're gonna uh, with um, draw her with freestyle. That means no guidelines. We're just gonna uh, start off by drawing her hair first. Okay, so if you want to draw the picture very big, you can just draw this snake line very big as well. Okay, so she's uh, kind of like pretty simple design character so I hope uh, it, it won't take too long to draw her alright so this uh, we are just basically adding some more uh, lines so so uh, it will look uh, more like hair uh, her, uh, her she have like um, pretty much a lot of hair so it's basically adding some more lines so it look like that. So then we are now getting uh, this um, weird shape, kind of, kind of looking like an army seal. Okay, so now we can work on the left side, okay, right below that, about halfway. Gonna do it up, okay, and then curve, curve it down, then kind of like a curve it in a circle shape, alright, like that, right here. So, hope I am not. Uh, any, any confusing and but with this line is we're going to draw kind of like a kind of like a snake line right here okay so this will be kind of like the uh, kind of like the hair right in the middle all right now we can draw the another part of the hair will be right here okay so I try to like draw the uh, easy um, part of the hair and then we're gonna Build up the uh, build up the complication of the hair, build out the style with uh, more lines to it. Okay, so that's basically the side view of the hair. Okay, then we can, if you want to, we can uh, do another line, do another hair like kind of straight down here, right here, about right here. Okay, so this do a line down, kind of, kind of look like a needle. Uh, life right here. Okay, then another one right there where the face is. Okay, so that's um, basically her face. Okay, face hair right here. So that's two of them. Okay, and then what, uh, where that is, we're gonna put a nine down for the ear. Okay, so the ear is about right here, and then for her face, it's kind of more like a uh, circular uh, face. Alright, so we're gonna do it a little bit circular like that. Okay, so that's basically what her hair look like. Okay, so if you want to, you can uh, do another line right here, curvy. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna expand the hair by drawing with the areas. We're gonna like curve out and then curve down. Alright, so that's basically the hair. Okay, right. For this part is we're gonna do some uh, curving line again. Okay, so uh, we're kind of like drawing a piece of paper right here. Okay, so the next part is gonna be easier because we got the line down. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so that's like the next part of the hair. So we're gonna see how like very long hair. So we better like uh, draw like pretty long. Okay, so that's basically the hair shape. Okay, so. We so we're gonna um, finish off the uh, left hair by drawing a line curve down like that. Okay, so that's basically her hair. Then we can draw the uh, a few more um, sketch lines for the neck. Okay, so we're gonna curve a line down. So that's one part. The next part will be right here. Okay, and then we can draw her jacket. Okay, which is a um, pretty simple design as well. So I. Uh, like how the uh, author of this, uh, uh, I guess the comic book, uh, designed the characters very well. It's very easy and a little bit 
pretty simple and pretty good looking um, style okay, for her okay so that's like basically the um, the left hand okay so we're just gonna draw a line then we're not going to um, draw out the hand because it's, um, it's a lot easier if you don't draw out the hand so that's like basically her top part okay so we don't have any space and then we're going to draw the uh, left shoulder okay so let's do the same thing let's draw a triangle shape okay so that's will be the column and then kind of like a straight line down okay kind of, kind of more like a um, business suit okay so let's gonna draw it up and in okay so that's like the uh, business suit okay so let's add in a few more lines for the detail of this uh, business suit okay then for her uh, left hand she's kind of like uh, it's kind of it kind of like a little bit accelerating because uh, the other drive is pretty long so we're gonna draw it pretty long as well so it's gonna um, kind of like drawing a straight line up and notice it's kind of past the where the hair, uh, hair is okay so do the same thing on the other side as well okay so i got to do it from top to bottom Okay, so let's draw a line down right here, kind of like a straight line up right here. Okay, so it's kind of like as notice very long. Okay, so we can now we can like draw her fingers holding a a bottle. Okay, so that you don't like. Okay, so it's a female character. So make sure you want to draw the fingers like very skinny. Okay, not not so rough okay so you, the lines are more clean with the female character because uh, you look no, more like a female character if you don't put much of a detail in the hand okay so it's basically uh, like very clean lines okay so that's like basically it for the uh for this jacket right here okay so that's like her arm Okay, then now we can draw this um, apple juice bottle she's holding. Okay, so it's pretty simple. Okay, so we're not going to put a lot of time on it. So we're going to draw it down, up, and down. Okay, so we're going to do the same thing on the other side. Up and down. Okay, then we're going to do the shape of the bottle. So the shape will look like this. Okay, then we're gonna draw the uh draw the logo right here. Okay, the last part is we basically draw an apple. Okay, right in the middle. Okay, so that's basically an apple. Yes, and here's like the uh, juice inside of it. Alright, so that's like basically it for the uh for the arm. Now we can draw her uh, I guess that's the paint. Okay, kinda of looking like a paint. Okay, can I expand this line the middle? Okay, just add uh, some detail now right there. Okay, so we can draw her uh, shirt to basically draw a line over. Okay, so we're gonna draw a curve line down. Okay, so that's like basically her pant. Okay, so we can draw uh, two lines, three lines right there to iron the detail of this, uh, like the style of this pant. Okay. Then we're gonna draw a few circles as well for um, for the style of the, uh, this jacket. Okay, so that's basically her jacket. Then we can uh, iron a few more uh, finish touch for the hair. Okay, so it's basically draw the hair a little bit longer on both sides. Okay, so this one is a little bit more little bit more uh, more hair rolling inwards and you know okay. alright so we're gonna draw like a few more lines alright then, the, then that's like uh, basically her hair then the next part we're going I am going to uh, let me uh, one more thing right there her top part of the shirt okay 
in the next part I'm going to uh uh like draw the face okay the face is kinda more like uh a little bit more complicated so I'm gonna use a regular mechanical pencil since it's drawing the face regular um, pencil alright so we're just gonna draw in like uh you uh, kinda like last kinda like uh what kind of stuff is that face okay so that's basically the eyebrow on the top okay so it's kind of like a straight line okay so it's uh, over okay make sure to add a pretty bit because it's a female uh female character usually uh female character eyes are a little bit or a lot or not a little bit maybe a lot bigger than the uh then the male character art okay, so it's kind of like speaking in here you know. alright so that's like basically uh, the face and the nose will be like a line and then for the mouth it will be going like, like kind of like a sad face right here okay then that alright so now let me uh, ink over it which is uh, this uh, using my ink pen. The only reason why I'm using an ink pen right now instead of a uh, regular pencil is because it be like a lot easier to see. Okay, uh, you too feel since the quality of the like the uh, um, resolution of the video is not that high. So uh, mm, I'm, I'm afraid that you, know, you guys cannot see the uh, lines for the drawing. So. So I use an e pen instead of a regular uh, mechanical pencil. Okay, so it's basically produce the same quality as using an e pen. It's just an eye. Alright, so for the eyes, we're gonna um, basically draw a, draw a circle. Okay, so that almost fill up the whole, um, whole eyes right there. Okay, so just that means the story circle that's like pretty big. Okay, so that's like two circles. Okay, and then the eye pupil is kind of like uh, it's circle. You can like draw a circle right here. Okay, then connect the circle. Alright, then you almost circle right there. Alright, I hope you guys can see that video. Okay, so we're gonna do that on the other side as well. Okay, draw so a half circle on the top. Okay. Then then connect and there's another circle within the eyes and another circle in the middle of the hair. Okay, so that's basically how you draw the eye pupil. I hope you guys can see it pretty well. So let me um, color in the white spot with this black color so you can like, see it a lot better. Alright, so that's basically how you draw the left eye. Okay, so we're gonna do the almost. Uh, basically the same thing on the uh, left eye alright so it will look like this so now you can look more like uh, her ok so the next part we are going I am going to uh, color this with color pencils ok so I'm gonna uh, start off by using um, regular yellow Crayola yellow so it's like basic common type of Color pencil, nothing special about those color pencils. You can pretty much buy anywhere else or a different brand. It produces the same uh, quality. So one more thing to remember is that uh, make sure you want to put something like uh, very smooth, like a pretty thick piece of paper. Put it under the joint so when you color it, um, the color will look more smooth out. Okay, when, when you color, make sure you want to push down the color pencil as hard as possible. Okay, so that way you can get all the color out of it. Okay, so I'm gonna use it. Color this real quick, and I'll be back. Alright guys, once you got the uh, yellow coloring pencil, 
yellow color done like this then we gonna switch to uh, raspberry okay it's kinda like a purple color so it's not kinda like dark purple okay if you don't have raspberry you can replace it with uh, not purple pink okay uh, I don't know what kind of color it is uh, that's my pink color will be okay alright so uh, I'll, I'm going to use this raspberry pink to color the rest of the hair and I'll be back Okay, and the next step, I'm going to switch out to a, a different color pencil, which is uh, dark brown. Okay, so this is still a uh, Crayola color pencil. So I'm going to use this color pencil to color her jacket. Okay, so when you color, you make sure to um, color it on a shape of a circle. Just like, and uh, basically, keep drawing pencil, and then uh, keep drawing pencil, keep drawing circles. Okay, so make sure you want to press down as hard as possible and do it to the rest of the jacket. The next, uh, I'm gonna switch to yellow orange to color the uh, her pants. Okay, so for this uh, shirt color, I use uh, Word Chill, which is basically a uh, kind of like a purple color. Okay, so I'm going to use yellow orange to color her pants, and then I use um, purple to color this uh, stripe right here and leave this stripe white. Okay, so I'm gonna color this and I'll be back to explain. Okay, and the next step, I'm going to use a uh, peach, peach color to color her skin. So if you uh, don't have peach color, you can uh, find similar color is and uh, similar to a skin color like that. And so, so when you color the uh, skin, you don't want to put them, don't want to put them like, too hot. You want to put them as like light as possible, just to get the uh, uh, the, the peach color out of it. Okay. So basically do that to the um, to all the skins right here and right here. Okay, so I'm gonna also do it in a tiny and I'll be back. In the next part, we're going to get a light blue. Okay, I don't know what this um, this color is called. Is this blue is typical? It's called um, turquoise. Yes, I don't know. I've never seen this word before. So it's um, spelled T U R Q U O I S E. Okay, so I hope you can <laughs> find color pencil that's similar to that. Okay, so this um, gonna color color the eye pupil. Okay, with this uh, blue and light blue color pencil. Okay, so I noticed that I need a little white spot right there to make it to make the eye eyes uh, look more shiny. Okay, the last part is gonna color the, um, the apple red. All right, so that is basically it for how to draw and um, sunset shimmer. Okay, so I. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoy this video as much as I did. I hope you also hope you have successful time drawing this. Okay, so it's kind of like pretty and 
High level joint, if you did it, you are like pretty good, pretty good artist. You'll become a pretty good artist in the future. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll be back with a new video as soon as possible.